hello guys today we are going to do one more program for conversion in which we are going to convert binary number into decimal so let's start we'll create a new project here just give name as binary to decimal click on finish i have a diagram let me show you this is the binary to decimal conversion structure so we are going to do that let's start i just need import statement here import java dot util dot scanner class let me just remove these unwanted comments here so first i need a variable let me declare as int binary number which has to be entered by the user i need decimal number which we are going to calculate let me initialize with 0 okay i am going to do program using constructor if you want you can directly write into main method itself so let me create a constructor here binary to decimal you can avoid just writing constructor and you can just write entire code in the main function itself let me just create a object for that constructor it would be obj is equal to new binary to decimal and I need a function which is going to calculate so I am just creating one public void calculate decimal and if you already know what the constructor do we just going to call through the object so obj dot cal decimal we are going to print a message for the user so system dot out dot print here and display message like enter a number or it would be binary number let me also create a scanner class object it would be scanner user input and let me just define it user input is equal to new scanner it would be system dot in as a parameter scanner class allow us to take the input from the user let me just take an input it would be binary number is equal to user input dot next dot next in function so we have taken the input now we just need the logic here so I need only one loop here so I will be using while loop here while binary number not equal to 0 we require two more variable so let me declare it it would be reminder and i should be equal to 1 initially now we just going to calculate the reminder so we just write reminder is equal to binary number modulo 10 
so every time we will calculate the reminder we will perform some operation and last we will going to add all those number and print those value so let me show you diagram here every time we just going to calculate reminder and perform some operation later on we just add all these numbers 100816 and we'll calculate the decimal value so next step would be decimal number is equal to decimal number plus reminder into i later we just increment i by 2 or i into 2 so every time it would be 1 2 4 8 and so on and the last step would be just decrementing the decimal number so it can be done using decimal number is equal to decimal number divided by 10 and finally we just going to print those value to be system dot out dot print decimal value is number i am going to write some more statement in between to clarify and you will understand the actual logic so let this is the basic structure of the program this is the actual logic but adding one more line using just printing each value you will get proper understanding let me save this and we'll test the application so let me show you what is the basic we have just created the object here we have initialized some variables and we ask user to enter a number in a binary format and from the function we have calculated the decimal value so i will add some more statement here let's test this application first go to run clean and build the project so we have successfully built the project let's test the application let me enter simple binary number it would be 1010 okay there is something wrong let me check okay we just have done some small mistake here we have just decremented here decimal number which has to be a binary number so let me just modify this every time we have to decrement the binary number go ahead and clean the project again let me test the application so it is asking a binary number so let me enter 1010 so binary value is 1010 and its decimal value is 10 So let me add some statement here in this loop, so we will be having better understanding. So here I have added some statement here. I am just going to print reminder value. Then we are going to print what is decimal value and which is got multiplied. Later on we just calculate what is the binary number after division. So it will give you proper definition or proper understanding of logic. So just I have added three statement here, four statement, these two system and this one, and the last one to printing the binary number. So we will going to save, going to clean and build the project here. We are going to test the application. So I need a proper window. I am going to use that example which we have used. So it would be one one zero one 
1001 so now you can understand in a proper way first we calculate the reminder so every time this is the binary number every time we just calculate the reminder so last digit will be calculated is modulo 1 initially previous decimal value is 0 we are performing this so it would be this operation is performed and decimal value is changed to 1 and when we divide binary number by 10 so every time binary number is decremented next time modulo will be 0 previous decimal value which was here so it will be added here 1 so every time it is performed so you can see 1 2 4 16 32 and 1 2 8 every time previous decimal value is added with the current one so decimal value is 217 from the diagram itself you can see how i am getting 0, 1 into 1 0, 0, 8, 16 and so on if you want this code for this program you can check my below link If you like this video, please like, subscribe and comment. Thanks for the watching.